What's up, YouTubers? It's 1996. Just got a quick mail day and somewhat of a rant. Not really a rant, but somewhat of a rant. The other day, well, I'll say that for last. I got one TTM here. And I'll just show it to you real quick. TTM large load. Not sure who it is. Oh, and if you're a hardcore sports collector, I'm sorry that I do these celebrity mail days some days. I hope you uh, can bear with them. And normally I'll say something in the title about a sports figure or something if it's a sports autograph. And today it's not a sports autograph. But if you are a diehard sports collector and get tired of watching the celebrity aut uh, autographs, I apologize. But let's see what I got today. And a cornucopia. So that's sports. She's high, but it's sports too. Son two. Son three. So and a cornucopia. Son three to three. Now for my rant. Uh, I bought a guitar pick frame from a uh, gesture and it cost $35 shipped 19 for the or 19 for the frame and $17 shipping so $36 shipped and they shipped it in this box and it weighed less than a pound I'd say 12 ounces at most and seventeen dollars for the shipping. I thought that was kind of excessive. The frame is pretty cool, but it's not what I was expecting. I was expecting a modern feat of engineering, and it's pretty. It looks cool. I admit it does look cool, but it's just a thin piece of sheet metal. I thought it would be more heavy duty than that. And it's in a little cheap frame which is good of them to supply the frame and everything but also I thought you'd be able to see both sides of the pics but as you can tell you can only see one side of the pics but that's not something I can complain about because I just didn't check into that but uh, this is my autographed pick frame and it does look pretty cool I give them that this is Clint from Seven Dust Fish from Digital Summer Guido from Digital Summer Corey Chuko from Rebuild Kelly and Shania Twain fame uh, Jorma Kalkinen from Jefferson Airplane, Hank Williams Jr. from Hank Williams Jr. and Buddy Guy from Buddy Guy. Uh, oh, and there's Pete Wentz, the one I got off eBay. I'm not, still not sure on the authenticity of that. But I was showing you all this before, but I was just showing you again since I got my frame. I figured I'd tell you about it. I hear their stick holders are pretty high quality. Their drumstick holders, so if you need a drumstick holder, uh, go to Jester. Just type in Jester drumstick holder on Google and you'll find it. Uh, but if you need a guitar pick frame, I would suggest going to eBay and buying the ones they've got there. It's called PIXXSPIXXS.com. I would suggest that one. I haven't tried it yet, but I think that it would be a better frame. And it costs $50. The frame insert costs $14, but if you get the frame that goes with it, it's a floating frame so you can see both sides of the pig. It's $50 total, but that's what I'm going to get next time. So, yeah, just check them out if you're into that kind of thing. All right, sorry to keep you so long. Later, 1996.